sorry, buddy. Why United States post office Santa Monica? Let's see the respect my rights. Because you're not buying anything and you're impeding my customers, so I need you to step out. We got too many people six feet distance. You see the uh, sign, the, the uh, line, so can I please have you step out? It, sir, I need you to step out. Why am I was already because inside you're here. not purchasing anything and my people are purchasing. Huh. So I guess he was too scared to buy anything. This is called loitering, silence boy. Also, you're not being really silent, now are ya? You don't tell me what to do, dude. You don't tell me what to do, okay? Stop barking orders, okay? You cannot be here. Stop barking your orders, dude. Nobody's barking, you're the one that's screaming. You're the one barking orders. Okay, you need to go around. Yeah, why don't you just go around it? So you put it on my sidewalk, I can go through it any time I want to. I don't need permission of no one. Not even these guys. If you want privacy, put tape, yellow tape, that's it. Okay. Or you can just listen. <laughs> Listening. They don't learn, they don't listen. That's what they do. Sorry, buddy. Why United States Post Office, Santa Monica? Let's see the respect my rights. Yes, good job there, Silence Boy. You are filming, and they will see. I'm guessing that's what he said. I mean, why is he talking to himself that he is filming? Is he confirming that he's filming? I, I, I don't understand. I tried to get the audio back, but he's whispering so silently. That's his silence boy name in action, isn't it? It's also very creepy. Stop that. I'm glad you know I could film. That's what I wanted to hear. Huh? I'm glad you know I could film. That's what I wanted to hear, finally. Yeah, well, you as long as you're not filming here and feeding, you have to step back. You can't feed on there. Yeah, I know. I've been to all the post office in the city. Okay, so you need, yeah, you're too close, so you have to step back. No, I have to do this. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah, I will. As far as I have to protect myself. <laughs> Say something go down. I don't know who he is. Hey. I'm scared of a simple camera. Okay, but you, you do have to step back because there's crash registers here. You do have to step back. 
I could be here, remember. No, you have to be back and we got the yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm moving the over there on the other side. Already was inside here. Yeah. What exactly do we have here? He's inside the post office, filming. Postmaster didn't actually know that he's not allowed to film and she's allowed to trespass him. But she still wants him to leave because he's loitering, not buying anything. And getting in the way of all that social distancing goodness. You know, only so many people are allowed inside the post office at any given time. But hey, he was already inside here. What the fuck is that accent? Hashtag team no accent has no time for this. <laughs> You have to step out. There's too many people in here. You have to step out, sir. Why am I wasn't better already? Because you're not buying anything and you're impeding my customers, so I need you to step out. We got too many people six feet distant. You see the uh, side, the the uh, line. So can I please have you step out? It, sir, I need you to step out. Why am I was already because inside you're here? you're not purchasing anything and my people are purchasing. You can't just come in here and occupy a space. You have to be purchasing. So because of the COVID, I need you to step out. If you're unable to do it, then I'll call the police and have them assist you. But right now, you're impeding the work of the buying customer. Let me have some out, please. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome. Sir, I'm, I'm asking you nicely. Do I need to get law enforcement involved? Why if I really wasn't here? That's my question. Because you're Before not purchasing people. nothing. You're just here filming. Yeah, These people are really purchasing know. something, so this is what this post office is for. You want to film, you can film out there, out there. As, you can come back and film as long as we're not over the capacity. And right now we're over the capacity in here with the COVID. So can you teach that okay. guy? And um, I, I've already told him. And I'll leave. But can I, but you teach him? No, I can get the police to assist you. Because that guy is, doesn't know. Oh, contraire, silence boy. You're the one who doesn't know. Also, can you use the wordy bits of English? I mean, what the hell is this wordy bit you're using? It's not English. It's weird. Be ashamed when a foreigner's outclassing you in your own damn language. Uh -huh. Yeah, even cow speaks better English than you. Oh, I, I already was inside here and he's telling me to get out when I was here right inside before all these people. And now you're refusing to brain? Refusing to English, refusing to brain, being a frauditor. That's three strikes. You're out, silent boy. I'm gonna just move here, but... Yeah, I'm just starting a big old line. Mm -hmm. Big old line here. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna just move here, but... Let me see your phone number to this one. I'm talking to these people. It looks like they'll never learn everybody. They're just the same, same, same walking things. So you've been talking to these people and they will never learn anything? Or anyone? Did you say anyone? Why are you speaking the English so weirdly, man? I don't understand what you're saying. For fuck's sake, what the hell is this? I mean, I don't have a problem with your any voice, but come on. Use English fucking words and grammar. And the post office is small inside there. So. What? What, did, what is he saying? And the post office is not inside a thing? What does that even mean? If you want, you could come here. This one right here. So 
So I'm heading to the next location. I'll keep you updated. And everybody, stay safe out there. And I'm starting to understand why this guy calls himself Silence Boy. Maybe you need to use text on screen or something because this is starting to get ridiculous. That last part I did understand, but holy hell. Yeah, stay spiffy, stay safe out there. What, what do you mean another location? Jeez. Was that a scene transition while your audio was still playing from the previous scene? This guy is trying to piss me off, isn't he? Uh. Oh wait, there you are. Damn it, cow. Uh. Do your job, dude. Really? Really? What the fuck are you doing, man? You're just standing there creepily with your fucking camera and then telling this man to do his job? Hey, guess what, Silence Boy? He got called because your dumbass was inside the post office, not listening to the postmaster to get the fuck outside. And now you're telling this man to do his job while he's doing his job. You know what? Get a job. They called you for me filming, dude, and you're telling me I'm okay. Just do your job, dude. That's what we should be doing. Yeah, no! Tell me when he does something interesting! No, they called the cops on me because I'm filming. The what? They called the cops on me because I was filming. Oh. Inside there, the post office. Oh. But I could do that. That's my right. <laughs> Have a good day, lady. We're back in, look, I'll show you. Mm -hmm. I guess that cop was too scared to even talk. No, you utter dick fluid. He wasn't too scared to talk to you. He was just talking to you and you didn't even answer his question. This is some issues with authority, isn't it? I guess this guy got bullied in school all the time and is still being bullied in his adult life. This, this isn't even bloody fake bravado. This is non-existent bravado. This is... I have no words for this. So, you're still loitering at the post office while you actually have been asked to get the hell out? This guy is not silence boy. He is special boy. I was too scared. But I'm here, as you can see, I stunned my ground. As usual. Oh, how adorable. He stood his ground. I mean, I've, I've been through your comment section as well. Everyone is taking the piss out of you, even the other frauditors. Imagine being a fan of this guy, because there's some of those as well. This guy's just wasting taxpayers, as usually. Look right there. He's, he's wasting taxpayers. He's wasting taxpayers. Is that... He said... Did you know what he said? He said he's wasting taxpayers. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> so I I tend to watch the audio profile and I thought he was gonna talk in this area. So hey, let's fast forward the rest as well because he is silence boy after all. He does not speak. I haven't heard him actually speak. It's just random noises coming from his wordy bit maker. Well, this guy was even didn't even enter the. <laughs> All right, now you're doing it on purpose. Uh. I'm wondering how long he's gonna talk there. This is in a Monaco PD. <laughs> Hello. 
So we'll make it quick. There we go. Walk of shame. The, the walk of shame inside the, the the walk of shame inside the car. The walk of shame. This he's just going down the list of fraudster points, isn't he? There you go. So good. He's well, no nothing better to do. Just waste time. See you again where he's gonna go. He gave a ten over there and go this way. This guy's just wasting taxpayers' money as usual. Now you utter dick flute. It's you that was the cause of this entire waste of taxpayer money. He got called in, so he has to respond. That is his job. You don't know what a job is, no one is surprised here, and the projection of you calling someone else a time waster. Now enough of that, let's have a look at your riveting content of a traffic stop situation. Hey, can you go around? Go around. You don't tell me what to do, dude. You don't tell me what to do, okay? You see this? Stop barking orders, okay? You cannot be here, okay? Okay, this is public, dude, this is public. Go around. You go around, this is public, dude. You can go around, listen. This public, put tape okay. if you want it. Okay, it's an officer safety. Okay? okay? Just watch him, watch him. You can film, just stay on the street. Stop barking around. orders, dude. You work okay. for me. No one is barking orders. You work for okay. me. You understand Listen, that in your head, if dude. You want, if you want to film, just stay over okay? there, please. Stay over there. Put tape, I'm going to the other side. Well, then you need to go around. Okay? So you need to go around. No, no, tell me. You need to go around. Stop barking your orders, dude. Nobody's barking. You're the one that's screaming. You're the one barking orders. Okay, you need to go around. Okay? Your friend is barking too. Just okay? go around. You don't no, tell me what to do. do, never in my life, okay? That's all we're asking you to do. You never tell me if what you to do. Stay here, film over there, please. Okay? You're fine to do that. You're not gonna tell me what to do. You're gonna stay there? And you're gonna give me your card number when you leave, dude. You're gonna stay right there? Okay? You're gonna give me your oh, card number. Please. Hey, did you just see uh, what happened there? This lady is not antagonizing the police, not harassing the police, not cop the police, not trying to film the police. He knows what you're trying to do, little frauditor. The cops have been informed about frauditors instigating a reaction from police officers. So this is the reason why you are being stopped. I mean, you can film. He didn't say you couldn't film. He's also not barking orders. You're the one who's yelling. Uh -huh. So you could see this is my sidewalk. I could go through it anytime I want to. I don't need permission of no one. Not even this guy's. Holy hell, man! I'm on the edge of my seat here. Fuck sake. Give me your business card, dude. Stay over there. You don't act like that, dude. Like what? You, you act like a human. You don't act like that. It's public. I could be anywhere I want to, You're dude. You're the one that's screaming, right? You're the one that's screaming. That's Nobody why the community screaming. doesn't like LAPD. You put yourself in those shoes. Nobody here was screaming except you. So they let him go now. Look, poor guy. Had him arrested. Yeah, why don't you talk to him and find out what happened? Because you arrest people for no reason. Yeah, was he, he under arrest? arrest? Was he under arrest? You had him in handcuffs, dude. Does that no, mean no. he's arrested? But yeah, that's violating people's rights, dude. I didn't know you were lawyer. If you want privacy, put tape, yellow tape, that's it. Oh, okay. Or you can just listen. Why do I have to listen to you? You're not no one let, let to me, me. Let me explain something to you, okay? When we're conducting an investigation, when you come up to this point, you're impeding the investigation, okay? That's why we were told you need to stand over there. You can film. We don't have a problem with filming. We're filming right now. That's okay. But you can't get that close when we have stuff going on. And we ask you to do that, and then you become confrontational at the same time, thinking you can go and do whatever you want. Put tape, as I said in the beginning. Okay, cool. Oh, I'll remember that next time. Okay? This is my Thank street you. public. Thank you. I heard what he said. This is my street public. You speak the English, do not do you. That's a pathetic grasp of the English language right there. Also, the rest of his video is him talking to this dude. I'm not interested in that at all. You can find it on this channel if you do want to see it. And on that, redirecting notes. Remember to pick up the bell and all what's around it. Have a look at that you can play when I do stuff over there. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Uh, this one added something special to the fraud at the list. Refusing to wordy bit. It's not even refusing to English.